So I was just warming up some hot pockets. A nine-year-old calls 911 saying no one else is home, and there's an issue with the microwave. It started to um, spark a lot. Okay, so it's sparking? Yes. And it's making a noise like there's metal in there. Teach them how to take care of themselves. Uh, that way that takes care of a majority of the issues. Best practices right. say no child under 12 should be home alone. But these times are so outside the norm. Seminole County's fire chief says they're seeing more children calling 911 because of issues in the home. He's hoping parents will take time with their children for their own protection. If they're going to be left at home, uh, give them some initial instruction on safety tips. Uh, when to call 911, when not to call 911. I got scared, so I started crying a little. Safeguard the home. Uh, make sure that for the smaller kids, any of the, the household chemicals, and, and we're going to probably have a lot more of those now that we're disinfecting anything, are out of reach of, of the children. The chief says the dispatchers do their very best, of course, to walk the children through what's going on at their home to make sure that they are protected and safe. He also says it's a good idea for the parents to make sure there's a charged phone at home so those kids can call for help if needed, and to make sure that the smoke detectors in the home have fresh batteries. The, the safeguard against all of this is not having the accident to be Begin with. In Seminole County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.